Mongolian's just Chinese. That's a That's different China. kind of Chinese. It's just a type of China. That, that, they got a damn new type of Chinese. Do they? Mongolian. Mongolian. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, Mongolian barbecue is the best food. Yeah, it's true. Yo, sh- we should the best is the up. places where they let you just go ham. On the fucking put every yeah. ingredient, yeah, every yeah, yeah. sauce, yeah. Oh, good and then, God. And, then, and then, but then you do a buffet style where you have like just you pay fifteen dollars to enter and then you get whatever the fuck you want. Well, my dick stiffens when I see that yeah. shit, dude. Did you go to the Mongolian barbecue place in uh, in the Ozarks? That fucking bolt, the, the comedy club, the casino. That's actually a good a good no. gig, but in the middle of fucking nowhere. No, no, no. The Arkansas oh, gig. Yeah, the 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 guy, the kid who was opening. <laughs> I say kid. He was like fucking five oh, years the old. The Indian guy. Me. Yeah, the Indian guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, he does. He does. Uh, shit. He works for Smuckers. Yeah, he does. He he works for like a peanut butter and jelly company, and you know he's he's pretty funny. Yeah. For a guy that lives in the mi- literally the middle of fucking it's incredible, nowhere, dude. Mm. And he has this like fucked up visa, where he's only allowed to work for Smuckers. So he can't <laughs> really wait. He's from India, straight yeah, up. He's, no, he's from like Bangladesh or something. Yeah, I don't remember. S- straight up. All right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, and so he, when he does comedy, they just can't pay him. What? Yeah. He like won't <laughs> negotiate like an under the deal table. That's why you get paid so much if you feature there. Is because oh hell yeah. He's like just give my pay to the feature act. Oh nice. That was a wow. Fat, that was a fat stack. Yeah. yeah. That was no, a nice. He's a cool. He's a cool guy. Yeah, and he's and uh, so if you're ever in the middle of fucking Oklahoma or Arkansas or whatever, yeah, it is, this, go check out the the mm-hmm. one comedian. He's Indian. I forget his name. Me too, but he was a cool guy. Yeah, um, <laughs> but he brought us. Well, you know, because he lives in a small town. Mm-hmm. So even though he's like Indian, and he comes from like a country with you know some of the best food. Yeah, I think in yeah. the world. Yeah. I mean, the reason they were colonized is because the British the were spices, like, spices. All of these spices. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Some British guy ate a samosa. Yeah, right. And his yeah. dick and got like, hard for I the first need time. To rape. <laughs> Oh, like literally, <laughs> yeah. literally, right? Yeah. An something entire about, subcontinent. Yeah. Something about turmeric get your dick hard, dude. Uh, c- coming, coming, yeah. cumin. Shut the <clears throat> fuck up, dude. It's coming. Anthony Cumin. Yeah, um, that was stuff. So, uh, well, anyhow, so he comes from there. Yeah, and then he was like, "Yeah, let me take you to like the cool part of town," and it's literally a fucking strip mall. That's yeah. like, yeah, Papa John's. Yeah, <laughs> there was one bar, and it closed at 10 p.m. Yeah. on a Saturday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the bar Saturday closed night. at Whoa. 10 p.m. Yeah, I mean, yeah. like, uh, you know, it's so funny. It's like all those conservatives that get mad. They're like, I fucking told you Starbucks to write Trump on the cup. Right. And it's like all that shit is Starbucks centric because that's the only store in their town. Right. It's by far the cosmopolitan place. place. 